this is Michael Smalley with Looplane.com and today I'm addressing singles and sort of this idea or issue around online dating. Is it good? Is it not good? Is it healthy? Is it messed up? And one of the things I want to encourage you is that I'm actually as an expert in this for almost 17 years of counseling singles, married couples, parents, everybody in the marriage and family realm. What I understand about online dating and what I've experienced from clients is there's nothing wrong with it. And so I want to encourage you that, in fact, especially if you've graduated from college, because college tends to be a great time and place to be able to meet a lot of different people in healthy ways. It gets more complicated because not everybody wants to meet their future spouse at the bar. Okay? And so uh, and not everybody wants to meet their future spouse at the singles class at church. And so I think online dating is actually gives you a great opportunity to sort of screen out so things like eHarmony or now Match.com does a much better job screening people out is it's a great way to make an introduction with someone that really could be a meaningful relationship. But here's the what I want to caution you about. If you're going to engage with online dating, what you need to make sure is that you take security very seriously. And that means what you don't do is go meet someone at their place or somewhere secluded you got to make sure is that if you're going to meet someone through eHarmony Match and hopefully what we're working towards here even at Loop Lane is to be able to make those kind of connections as well is that you always meet someone in a public area so that you can be safe because your safety is first and foremost if you're going to be meeting someone initially online. And so make that place public and then as you get to know this person you can watch a lot of the other videos we have right here at Loop Lane in order to know if you're with the right person or not.